So today, Sunday, the moon moves through watery Pisces. It'll probably be Monday early for some of us. And the morning hours might have been quite productive, but yet troublesome after the moon conjoins frustrating Saturn and square Venus. The rest of the day should turn around nicely, though. With a trine um, to Mars and sextiles to Mercury, that aids. And it's an excellent day to connect with your inner feelings, your inner child. Um, maybe some of you might have felt you've needed rest where the beginning of the week was a lot better and the end of the week maybe got a bit heavy. If you've not seen the Astro update on YouTube, I would check that out because I also tell you about the moon movements and also Venus entering Gemini, which I'm going to do for your signs. There's also a video on Mercury retrograde, which will be up until the end of May post shadow and messages for your signs. And it's not the traditional fear factor Mercury, actually, it's a good chat and then a tap into your signs, uh, mainly around cardinal, fixed and mutable. So each one of you have a message and check your top placements in that. Um, I will be uploading mini messages for each sign individually in terms of Venus in Gemini. So Venus has just moved out of Taurus into Gemini and I will be uploading that. If you've not seen your check-in readings, your energy check-in readings, um, check those out. They're now up fresh out the baker's oven on YouTube as well. And um, the new solar eclipse, new moon is coming up. Some of us might feel like we need rest. Some of us might be raring to go. Just honour whatever you're feeling. And um, yeah, do check your readings out because it's going to help your individual sign readings and the other readings that are up. 